Well, now let's see how to add multiple assets at once. What's great is, you know, when you borrow some uh, kit batch from uh, marketplace like uh, Artation or Gumroad, uh, you have a lot of content and most of the time it packed on one file, uh, like uh, this example. Okay, everything is set. Even you, if you want to prepare a set for layout using asset it, it's great to do things like that. So there is two options for multi imports. Uh, I don't know if you have noticed, but when you wait on a button, you have a little tooltip that will help you to understand what this button is. So here we have the single asset add and two for multiple assets. We will use this one, which is to create multiple assets from one scene. Okay, so I open the pop-up editor. Always the same thing, the destination, where I want to save it. I will save it to my asset. Great. It's the same option, in fact. Uh, so you know if you want to save the texture, copy the texture with the patch. And the pivot option we have here, as we can't set it one by one, uh, asset it will, will, will do it uh, automatically for us. So yes, I want as you can see, my grid is here and my assets are everywhere. So I want it place each asset at the grid base origin. And let's create, I don't know, not too much, the, this asset. This one. Okay. So same thing. All will depend on your selection. Be careful. Here it's simple, but because it's only one uh, single merge mesh. So it will take the name of the selection. Uh, here I'm on a group, but it will put it on the root. So it will do everything for, for us. Just be careful about the name of your asset in the outliner here. Once everything is done, you just have to create clone, create assets. You will have a batch process uh, progress bar and you just have to wait its end to load into asset it. And voila, all my assets properly generated. Okay, great. Let's try this one in port file. Great. Now, there is a second option, um, which is to import file, but from an uh, external uh, file, which means, for example, uh, one file per asset. Uh, that can be possible sometimes. Uh, for example, here I would like to import the screw and bolt I created for a modit here, and. Uh, add it to asset it, why not? I will create a art surface tab and screw bolt, for example. Okay, um, there are here in mod it. So you see here how it is. It's one folder with only Maya saved. So be careful about that. Um, you can also this way import OBG FBX you see here you have the option, so be careful. One folder that, that contain only um, uh, file to import. So I will locate it. So this folder, it's MA file. I want to save in art surface, screen bolt, it's okay. I don't want to save material because there are no material, so only number one will be great. And yes, for the pivot, I will not set pivot because it's already set manually. So I know the pivots are great. And create asset, same things. And here are all assets import in only one click. <laughs> 